We arrive at the convention hall in downtown Pittsburgh and we find out that there has been so much response from some of the past episodes of the Friends of NRA TV shows, one in particular with the NRA Ford F-250 getting stuck in the Whittington Center. This one's gonna be bad. They wanted the truck on display. The NRA wanted it upstairs on the third floor where people were coming by and would be able to, to see the truck. And it's just, it's a cool truck. I feel fortunate to be able to drive it when I can when Jesse hadn't stolen the keys from me. This is quite an adventure. We just took the truck off of the elevator. I'm going to listen to you on this one. You're, uh, you're maneuvering. Maybe a professional well. shooter, but uh, you're a professional driver. Professional driver. I think the only reason he got it in there so easily was because my co-piloting skills are just top notch. I mean, I just I was right there. I didn't let him down. I said, "You got it over here. You got it back there." We're uh, we're looking for the NRA booth. Yeah. Anybody tell us where the NRA booth might be? Where are we? Where are we? <laughs> I feel pretty confident in my driving abilities, and I felt like, I, other than the time I got stuck in New Mexico. How's that mud feel? I usually am a pretty good driver. can handle my own in any situation. Not a scratch on it. I got to give you mad props. Really? Yes. Wow. Good driving skill. Thank I got to give it to you. You got I it up here. I didn't have much room to squeeze through the elevator, but we wanted to get it up here in the convention to let everybody see that the rig has been driving all over the country and getting the stories and meeting the volunteers all over. So tonight we're going to be at a banquet. We've got, got the auction. NRA banquet, the auction. Um, we got some ribbon cuttings. Yeah, if you've never been to an NRA national convention, you need to do yourself a favor and find out where location is for next year and get here because it's an awesome time. We've got the truck set up in the convention, and now we have to head to the NRA banquet to kick off the show. The night before the convention starts, Jesse and I find out that we're gonna have to take the stage and kick off this year's live auction at the banquet the first night. And I gotta tell you, I'm not um, what you would call a great public speaker. <laughs> And here is our host. Let's give them a big round of applause. Jesse Abbott and Matt Dunn. We have to get up and give a quick speech about the show, what we've been doing, and how much fun we've had. And then we're actually going to start the live auction. Uh, we're hosts of a TV show, but that doesn't necessarily mean that we're good public speakers. Uh, this was sprung on us last minute, but I got to tell you, I was nervous. Uh, it's been an honor. I may be able to talk a lot, but when there is a sea of people out in front of you and knowing what type of people that was in the crowd, just some, some very influential members of the NRA. I travel all over the country and see the selfless attitude and passion that you all have. Public speaking just ain't my thing. <laughs> 